Today I'm going to tell you about what I think is the best 5% categories credit card that has no annual fee. I'm talking about the US Bank Cash Plus card. Plus if you sign up you can get a $200 bonus. You only have to spend $1,000 and there's no annual fee. Now I got approved for this one recently and I didn't even know what I could do with this. I just thought this was a throwaway card, just another $200 bonus, but I completely missed out on some things that it has that really make it I think probably one of the best 5% cards out there. It has a 5% cash back on certain categories, but it allows you to pick two categories of your choice every quarter. And then you also get one 2% category. This is what really sort of sets this one apart. I mean, now the city custom card, you also have 5% categories. You don't have to select it. It's just based on your purchasing, but you've only got one top category. And the probably the closest thing would be the Chase Freedom Flex card. Now I have the earlier version of this, the card that they no longer have called the Chase Freedom card. And it doesn't allow me to pick the categories, but I've tried to apply for this one two times over the past couple years and I've been denied so this one allows you to pick 5% cash back and quarterly bonus categories such as gas stations grocery stores so you can select the category which is nice however this one is a MasterCard so if you're gonna go to Costco you're not gonna be able to use this one there's also the Discover IT card. I also have this. This is one of my favorites. I also have a referral card for Discover IT where you'll get $50 just for signing up with the card and making one purchase. Plus you get double categories the first year. The Discover IT card also has a 5% category, but they select the categories for you. And then it's 1% for all other categories. With the US Bank, you've got the 2% category also, and then everything else is 1%. So you've got basically, you've got three choices that you can make with US Bank, and then everything else is 1%. 5% cash back on two categories of your choice, fast food, TV, internet, streaming, cell phone, electronic stores, department stores, home utilities. Now the one I've selected is home utilities and TV, internet, and streaming. Now the thing that I really don't like about this that I would really love would be to have a 5% grocery category, but I think that's asking for too much. But they do have a 2% category and I selected the grocery category for the 2%. You can choose between grocery, restaurant, and gas. And I believe these categories, I believe these categories may change over time. However, I'm not sure I haven't had the card long enough. Here's the thing that I really like about this. So this is the part that I neglected after I signed up. I signed up, I spent $1,000. I didn't select any categories. So that meant that I was only getting 1% on all of those items that I purchased. So I missed out on up to $40. These are the categories for the current quarter. The 5% category is actually fairly large, but grocery stores is in the 2% category, not the 5%. Okay, here you go. Home utilities. It looks like it's got a lot of companies on here. Select clothing stores, department stores. They don't consider Walmart a department store. They have Best Buy in here. Under electronic stores, they have Best Buy, Newegg. Now you also have a 5% category that you could use for our fitness. And if you pay your fitness membership yearly, you could get 5% off your yearly membership. The thing that's nice about this is, let's say you're gonna pay for your gym membership once a year. You pay for 12 months at a time. You could select this gym category, you know, pay $100, $200, whatever it is, get the 5% on that, and then the next month, switch over to electronic stores or clothing stores or something else fast food and then get the 5% on that I also like the fact that they have the next quarter on here so they have October through December already listed so you could plan out what you're gonna do for the next quarter it appears that they have the same categories for each quarter however you have to select this each quarter that's the thing that's a little bit annoying you can't just keep the same thing each time you can't just keep the same thing you have to select these categories every quarter or you're gonna get only 1%, but they have a solution for that. If you scroll down, okay, here they have an optimizer. You, you can see which categories you spend the most money on and then do the 5% on those categories. Here's the thing that I like about it. So it is annoying that you have to do it every quarter. However, they have a never miss on more cash back. You can put in your email address and they will send a notification reminder when it's the end of the quarter that you need to sign up. So that's kind of a nice thing. So how does this compare to 
City Custom Cash, one of my favorite cards. Well, it's kind of hard to beat City Custom Cash because they have grocery stores that you can select for the 5% category. You're not actually selecting it. You would basically just use the card, spend the most amount of money at the grocery store, or use that card only for the grocery store or only for the gas station, and then you're gonna get 5% on that. So, however, I think the US Bank Cash Plus card combined with the City Custom card you can make up for the shortfalls in the US Bank Cash Plus card by doing the City Custom card. And then you could do, if there's no other cards that have 5% on groceries and you want groceries, you could just buy your groceries with your City Custom card and you're gonna get 5% back. Now the uh, the Chase Freedom Flex card, I'm not a big fan of the categories they have now. They have gas stations, which everyone seems to have, EV charging and select live entertainment. So. This one's kind of disappointing for this quarter. Right now, Discover IT card is kind of depressing too. It only has gas stations and digital wallets. Okay, what other credit cards offer similar rewards to the US Bank Cash Plus card? I did find another one from US Bank. Generally, I've been very disappointed with US Bank's checking accounts and savings accounts, but I've been fairly impressed with these credit cards that I'm seeing so far from US Bank. US Bank Shopper Cash Rewards Visa Signature Card. Earn up to 6% cash back at your favorite stores plus a $250 bonus. You're getting an over 10% return on the bonus, so that's better than what American Express. American Express has been doing 10%, so this would be $200 or less. And it seems like more recently they're doing, they would do something like 150 on 2000. But with American Express, it's more like 3000 that you have to spend. So this one, you get $250, you have to spend 2,000, and they give you an extra month, whereas most of them will only give you 90 days. This one, they give you four months. Don't forget to smash that like button. It really helps and it costs nothing. Also, feel free to subscribe if you haven't already and click the bell icon. Also, they give you $0 intro annual fee and then it's $95 after that. What do I like about the shop or cash rewards? Well, you get 6% cash back on your first $1,500 in combined eligible purchase with two retailers of your choice. So you get to pick the choice. You get 3% cash back on your first 1500 in eligible purchases of your choice in eligible categories like wholesale clubs, gas and EV charging, bills and utilities. 1.5% cash back for all other purchases. So they bump it up by half a percent on all of other purchases compared to the Cash Plus card. Okay, what categories do they give you? So the 6% categories, now they don't really have much of a grocery category for this one, but they do have Walmart. 6% at Walmart's a good deal. So Walmart has groceries, so I believe you can, so Walmart has groceries, so I guess you could use Walmart or Target if you're doing the grocery category. But they also have Amazon. Amazon at 6%, Apple 6%, Lowe's, Menards, Macy's, Home Depot, Ikea, Kohl's. So pretty decent. You know, I, I could imagine if you're doing a huge project, if you're doing a huge project or you're buying a lot of stuff, you could go to Best Buy and get the discount, Home Depot, Ikea, Lowe's. So not a bad deal. How does it stack up? Okay, the Amazon's card only gives you 5%. They're giving you 6% right now. Now they can change this at any time in the future. Lowe's, 6%. The Lowe's card only gives you 5%. US Bank's giving you 6. Target, if you get the Target card, it's only 5%. They're giving you 6. So I'm guessing this probably isn't sustainable. I'm guessing it's a promo deal. Costco, 3%, Sam's Club, 3%. So not the greatest on those wholesale clubs. You could sign up for this one, get the 250 bucks, try it out. And I believe you're not even gonna have to pay the $95 annual fee. You, If you didn't save what you thought you would, you could close it after that. Okay, now what about American Express? Does American Express have anything that's comparable to the Cash Plus card? They do have the Blue Cash Preferred card and it's a $0 intro annual fee the first year and then it's $95. So you're seeing here that the Cash Plus card is very competitive because it doesn't have an annual fee. Now it doesn't pay 6%. This one pays 6% cash back at US supermarkets up to $6,000 in purchases. That's $1,500 a quarter, just like the other one. 6% cash back on select US streaming subscriptions, 3% cash back on transit purchases. This one, you get $250 after you spend $3,000 in purchases within the first six months. This is still less than a 10% return. That really, they should be offering at least $300 or more. So Amex is always stingy with the bonuses. Okay, here you can see more info. 6% on groceries, up to 6,000 per year, 6% streaming, 3% transit, 3% on gas stations, 
1% on all other purchases. I think this is the winner as far as groceries goes because it's offering 6%, whereas you can't get that with the US bank card unless you consider Walmart and Target grocery stores. Not too bad on this one. Thanks for watching. I have a deal on a Discover IT cashback referral. If you don't already have the Discover IT card, you saw that it has some pretty good 5% categories. All you have to do with this, you sign up through my link, you get 50 bucks. All you have to do is make one purchase. Very easy. And you get those bonus categories and they double them for the first year. Unlimited cashback match. So those 5% categories become 10% categories for the first year. So pretty good deal. Also in my description, you can find links to other bank promotions and referrals where you can make quite a bit of money. So anyways, thanks for watching. Please Please make sure to like, share, and subscribe. It really helps. Thanks a lot.